Demonstrators take to the streets of Sacramento for the seventh night in a row, defying a citywide curfew to demand justice for George Floyd, a man who died in police custody, and they're also demanding criminal justice reform. This was the shot from Live Copter 3 about 9.15 tonight, and you can see a group holding a vigil at Cesar Chavez Plaza. Now, I want to show you the scene earlier tonight at the state capitol where the protesters headed over to, and they were once again there when they got there, they were peaceful, still defying though the city's 8 p.m. curfew. Protests across the country tonight remain passionate but peaceful as hundreds continue to demand police reform following the death of George Floyd in Minneapolis. Let's go to KCR3 Stephanie Lynn. She's live for us at Cesar Chavez Plaza right now in Sacramento. She's followed and watched the protesters all night. So how are things out there right now, Stephanie? Well, Golston, Lisa, it is quite peaceful out here at Cesar Chavez Plaza right now. Behind me, just a few folks cleaning up, sweeping up any debris that might have been left behind on the stage here. And you can see the memorial for Black Lives Matter uh, continuing to grow here at Cesar Chavez Plaza. A number of signs reading uh, justice for different individuals who have been uh, impacted by what these demonstrators have been calling police brutality throughout the course of these protests. Now, we had the opportunity to to march alongside and speak with a number of demonstrators uh, throughout the day here, and here is just what we've heard from the ground. What do you want people to remember from all this? I want to uh, want people to remember the unity, that strength in numbers, that Sacramento showing out and showing the support that we should always be a family, always a community, and we can do anything that we can do as long as we work together and put our minds together. Now, in terms of presence from the police, uh, much less uh, presence from Sacramento PD uh, compared to what we saw earlier in the week when we were marching by the Capitol steps. Uh, pr in prior days, we saw two, three rows of officers standing out on the steps. Today, we just saw a handful of officers out on the steps. And at the moment right now, we just see a few SAC PD vehicles parked out on the corners of the plaza here. We see some National Guard guardsmen uh, patrolling uh, the edge of uh, the plaza along uh, I Street, but otherwise it's looking pretty quiet out here. We haven't heard the loudspeakers on top of the different police vehicles enforcing a curfew like we have in prior days. So overall, it looks like they might be relaxing uh, law enforcement presence here, and the demonstrators are also no longer out here at this hour either. Golston, Lisa, back to you. Yeah, it was calm last night, even calmer it appears tonight. Stephanie, thanks for that. Now,